what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Instead of sending Donald Trump a pair of big ball of brand shoes to thank him for helping to persuade Chinese authorities to allow his son, along with two other UCLA basketball players, to return to the United States after they were busted stealing sunglasses from a Louis Vuitton store, LeVar Ball did the righteous thing and downplayed Donald Trump's role. When asked about Trump's involvement, LeVar Ball told ESPN on Friday night, who? What was he over there for? Don't tell me nothing. Everybody want to make it seem like he helped me out. Like I told Leangelo, they try to make a big deal out of nothing sometimes. I'm from LA. I've seen a lot worse things than a guy taking some sunglasses. My son has built up enough character that one bad decision doesn't define him. Now, if you can go back and say when he was 12 years old, he was shoplifting and stealing cars and going wild, then that's a different story. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Anytime you can get a chance to smash the gas on Donald Trump, one should do so. Because he smashes the gas on everybody else on a daily basis. Don't cut him no slack. Cut him no breaks. He's such an attention whore. You know, he made the statement that I wonder if any of those basketball players are going to thank me. I'm paraphrasing, of course. He went to Twitter, of course. I wonder if any of those guys are going to thank me. Thank you for what, fool? You did what you're supposed to do. That's like a that's like a father asking for praise and telling his child that he should be grateful and thank him for feeding him or clothing him. You sound like a fool. You thirsty, man. You thirsty. You need a drink. I like LeVar Ball a lot. As such, I only have one criticism about the comments he made. He said that they try to make a big deal out of nothing sometimes. Any member of the Ball family stealing anything is not nothing. It is a big deal. So let's not try to minimize that. That's a big deal and he messed up big time. But like you say, if you can go back and name where he messed up, he been stealing cars and breaking into houses or whatever since he was 12 years old, then that's a different story. So he don't really have a history of doing things like this. Let's hope that this is the last time he does something that stupid because I was floored when I heard about it. I was like, nah, man, that's just what they needed. That's all they needed because they can't stand a strong black man that's right there for his babies, protecting his boys. They don't like that. A lot of people don't like that. They want to try to separate them. It's like he was saying, I got you this for, didn't need none of y'all here. Now he's ready for the pros and now y'all want to take him away. Now everybody trying to tell me how to raise my son. Get out of here. I like LeVar Ball because they don't like him. Keep up the good work, man. And tell your son to use this setback as a setup to become a better person. This just in. Oh, wow, this is deep. This is from uh, a Secret Service agent of Donald Trump, a former Secret Service agent. I don't know if I should share this with y'all. Of course, I'm going to share it. says here, right under the big old word confidential, Donald Trump is so self-absorbed that at 3.45 a.m. every single day, 
he tries to give himself blowjobs. Wow. <sighs> no more talk. What, what, what the ladies talking about? Yeah. Florida, Texas.